we being at the club, after the club closed, we, we provide a public service, you know what I'm saying? You know, we put some on their stomach. We, we soak up the, the alcohol. We give, we stop them from getting the PWI. The food man from the food land at the food ass stand, yeah? Yes, sir. To boogity boogity. <laughs> the food ass man. took some concentrated effort. I was in prison when I came up with the idea of selling food after the club. I came up with that idea in prison. I've been doing it since 87, 86, 88, 90, 91. Ted Poe was going to give me life without the road. If I came up with another drug case, I had I had two drug cases. He told me if I get one more drug case, I was going to get life without the road. And I thought of a master plan. Everybody was thinking of the master plan. This is my master plan. Selling barbecue and food. Instead of selling illegal drugs, selling something legal. Food. Food and barbecue. My chicken. Even the judge was. Yeah, the courtroom 208, I'll never forget it. Yeah, I retired from the drug game in the courtroom. I stuck with it. I executed it when I got out, and I'm still doing it. Now it's like 30-something years I've been doing it. And it kept me out of prison. Helped me get my kids through college, everything. Yeah, it's been a dream that came true, yeah. Every night. <laughs> what you gonna do? I came through with the barbecue. It's going down. 